Sorry, Winter. Apologies. <laughs> there we go. Wards have been purchased. Smoke has Be been provided. And we are ready to go here with... With uh, what's actually uh, game one, two, three... Game five. Game five. Game five. Yes. Game five. Game five. Yeah. All right, Danny, we got you. Yep. Danny, sixty-nine, my Danny, man. Good luck. Uh, Danny, Danny, eighty-nine. Good luck what? Eighty-nine, not sixty-nine. Danny is not sixty-nine tonight. Danny is not a fan of the old sixty-nine. He's a fan of the eighty-nine. Yeah. Because he's got one at both ends. That's wonderful. Yeah. That's <laughs> bad. They should put him <laughs> in a museum. Oh, is that wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> uh, are you retarded? Well, it's, it's the best. That. The best of both worlds, yeah, I guess. On, let's not you be can't be too greedy. Hold on a second, Hang there. Hold on. Oh, like on the on the move right now. Oh my right. god, Dakota, oh. you're such a greedy, what? greedy oh. person. Don't say that about Dakota. He's so greedy. He wants everything. Leaves okay. nothing for everyone else. I want respect here. I guess All that's right. why LD wanted to hire him. Yeah. They have a lot in common. Yeah. <laughs> 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 the man who's not here gets blamed too. Oh, bless him. Yep. Yep. Well, here we have it. Bulldog. And here we have... RTK ready to go. He had a great game last game. Let's see if he has a good game. Let's do it, game. folks. This is game five. Game five. Get five. Grand final. Lots Get of money excited. on the line here. This is life changing money here. Life. Now, I had the opportunity to chat with uh, a player who is uh -huh. playing in the tournament and was uh -huh. already eliminated. Uh -huh. And you got to remember, even though the tournament seemed very crazy and almost, you know, wacky and a bit frustrating at times. <laughs> The players were in this one, man. This is life-changing money. And you which know? player was this? Or is this I, undisclosed? I, I, I'm going to leave it on this. I'm going to give them the okay. respect. So you didn't really dude. tell us the story. I'm not lying. What I'll was the story? I swear on my dog. You just life. said you <laughs> talked to a player <laughs> yeah. and you described the tournament. Just trying to validate yeah. himself. <laughs> like, well, I, talked mean, I talked to so and so. Players talked to me. <laughs> I was just oh chatting right. it I mean, up. What's, yeah. I yeah. was just chatting it up, you know? Okay. Okay. Thanks for your input. They had a lot to say. They had a lot to say. Yeah. Like, just like you, a lot to say. What? But nothing to share with us. Oh, Sorry, Winter. <sighs> well, the latest is that there's apparently been some uh, life-changing Roshan calls. I Chinese saw that. Yes. Yeah. I did see that. Oof. Yeah. But, um, well, I'm sure it's all going nice and smoothly yep. over there. Our boy Danny's on it. Our boy Danny89 has sorted the current situation. Correction, Danny69. Huh? Yes. Yeah, it's 89. Are you sure? We've been through this. It's 89. Oh, Bulldog. Oh, cameraman. Oh, well, S4, cameraman. first blood, the loaded Who's tiny. Is it Roland? <laughs> Roland. Who's doing camera? We've got Roland. Over Roland, I, I'm not going to call names here. It's been a long... You know what, though? That should... He's, he's not on camera, by the way. Who's so. on camera? <laughs> This is a Chinese. Oh, the, Chinese oh, the ones you thought were so Chinese good. Ops. It may or may not be. They're the too busy ops. informing LGD when the Roshan was being taken. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> ah, it's understandable. It's, yeah. it's, hey, it's actually not the Chinese ops, but oh, I'll leave it at that. Why have we not? <laughs> I know who it is. Oh, I think I know what? who it is. Too. Oh, yeah, he's drawing <laughs> stupid shit. We know that. Oh, <laughs> okay. In trouble. Too busy seeing if Navi are back. <laughs> Got him. That's Parker. Give Come Navi a break. We They're did. not even playing. They're not even this playing. They're not playing. They gave, break. They gave yeah. themselves a break, yeah. you know? Come on. Why do we have to? Yeah. Have mercy. I think they're playing our next tournament. It's like a 5K amateur cup. <laughs> like <Whoa. laughs> we're doing like the BTS series. Okay. It's like, all right, Navi's like, yeah, we'll play. <laughs> That's great. Wow. Parker, you have been Parker banished from flames. this couch. <laughs> I'm clicking the mute button on you. I'm sorry. This that's not the button. That's, that's not the button. That's not the button. No, put that's his pants back uh, on. That's, that's the not lever. the Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Can't reconnect. One to one as we get into three minutes here. What team will fly their courier first? This is uh, the uh, game I like to play. Here we go. Who Are will you do ready? it first? Who's disciplined? Who will get the first winter. flying courier? Make the call, Winter. Here we go. Watch the map. DDC's Watch the map. Responsible support. Watch okay, the map. Okay, we'll see. First Somebody's one. On Not yet. Watch they the are map. a bit focused here. Here we go. We need Still it. Still both walking. It's coming oh, out on the top rubber. It's walking. It's gonna be. It's it gotta be. LG. It hasn't broken yet. his wings out what? yet. Oh, they're distracted. Bulldog gonna be taken down here. ROTK yeah. picks that one up. If they'd upgraded the courier, that wouldn't have happened. Yeah, both couriers. Still walking at this Still moment in time. Still walking. This is. Yeah, just, just like the games when you're playing with Dakota, 
Dude, I, uh, I, come on. I knew that no. I three the three minute mark hit, and that courier was in the air so fast, so fast. Still not flying. Yeah, Neither I can't believe courier this is right flying now. at the moment. This is a grand final, people. This is game five of a grand final. How can you tell? Did they change their icon in the minimap? You do see little wings. You'll see the wings. You sprout. see the wings. Come. Okay. Man, are you are you even watching the game or something? That's shit? your job. Dude, the flying career change has been always yep. like this. Yep, there we go. Changed. Sorry, game's over. LGD win that one. Ah, right, okay. There we go. Fine, that, yeah. LGD confirmed champions. Okay. Okay. Well. Base OD pixel. That's an omen Based of what's to come. Thank you. Thank you, Winter. Thank you for that. Cheers, mate. Ch thank you. Why, why are you being nice to me this evening, Winter? <laughs> because I want something back later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, that's staying. You deep complain about how many bees he had, Winter. You gotta yeah. slip him a few more. <laughs> That's a very evil laugh. <laughs> oh, oh, S4. Chains catch. Tosses the catapult here. Looks like he'll be fine as he picks up his power treads. All right. Lots well, of flirting in the mid lane. So far, CS wise, 21 for 5, 21 for 2 on the two cores of LGD. Radiant a little bit further behind, but. Naga not farming well at all. Well, it is a support Naga. Oh. Oh, wait, no, all it right. is. All right. <laughs> so it's like. It's like that. Alright, little, little skirmish is breaking out here and there. Ake okay, has been doing some poking here. That, there we see it again. Oh. The balls are flying. You know, this this has seemed to be quite useful for Chen right now. I, I think the few games that we saw Chen in this tournament, they all started in the off lane and, and they did this. They grabbed the creep near the, the ancients and they keep harassing the lanes. Yeah. Seems like the new way to play Chen. Yeah, man. Like Thank you very much, Mighty Frog. <laughs> says don't, all don't, you like it? Well, don't you like it? It makes the game more interesting. Oh, I love it. What, what were we talking about? Do you about? see how excited I was about the jungle and jungle action were, last time? I love it. You were being so sarcastic when you say thank you, balls, Oscar. Oh, what are you talking about? Don't yeah, you I can appreciate a micro player. What? The micro skills, if you will. I can appreciate that. All right. I love it. No, wow. I'm happy that Chen players have more Two options points. now. How many balls can you micro? Well, uh, enough. More than enough, I guess. Uh, experience. Glorious experience, you might say. Fantastic. Wonderful. Delightful. Astounding. Okay, stun well. on the bulldog here. He will be turned into a little fish. He will be killed. And as he goes down, MY will replenish a little bit of mana. The Not safe lane SS seems to be like a, a viable way of playing oh, the S4 now. here. Look at this smoke up. Absolutely beautiful. Moves in here. Cold feet. Oh, no. no. It's fine. It's a zoning avalanche, guys. It's a zoning avalanche. What was he smoking, OD? Well, I, obviously some wrong shit. Hey, I mean, you got the ember. That's a better kill. Yeah. That's all according to the script. Okay. Oh. Nice little lob back right there. And there's your hook shotty. Nice grave. Keeps S4 alive. He's oh looking to retreat God. back. Ake has been doing work with this Seder oh. creep. They what? get the net off. Hey! 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 Whatever he's smoking, I want some too, dude. Uh, okay, no, no, well, we no, can't. you're no, too no. young. Not you're too you. young. Not, not for, for you. you. Last time you had some of that stuff, you got crazy. Last time you had yeah. some of that stuff, you started to cast. Yep, and yeah. uh, it was terrible. Yep. Sorry, guys. It's all right. We I love we you. you. We forgive you. Three to three. Seven minutes in this one right now. Alliance. Well, they get the, the first early swing going for themselves, so we're at a, what's turning into a bit of a wash in the early game. I think this is looking nice. 3-3 three, three at the moment, the deciding game so far in this series. I've got to be honest, the four games that we've had, they've been fairly one-sided. You know, the first two, Alliance, they got the lead, they kept the lead. The second two, yep. uh, you know, second set of two, it was a, a, kind of the same the other way around. This one at the moment, okay. we even, mid lane, S4 turns around with the Avalanche, gives a bit of a toss -a and there's the Remnants. Bam! S4 oh, the with one the plays. Though. That one, though. That plus 30 HP. Thank you, Iris Frog. That one? That smoke. What? That's all that smoke. You're obsessed with the smoking. Lay it off, Winter. Lay it off. All right. Whatever the hell it was, LGD thought they had that one calculated, and they were off. They, they, they did didn't carry the one. They did not calculate that precise enough. It was close, but not quite enough. Yeah. And now... And now Bulldog doing the kind of the, the dance right here with Mr. OGK. And I like this as well. Would you yeah. like to do a dance with me tomorrow? Uh, no. No, I would not, Winter. Winter, please. Please. 
can you stop gyrating in front of me? Thank you. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Very distracting. Yeah. yeah. Gods, put your phone away. Gods. <laughs> yeah, that's not going <laughs> on. We're there, not right? filming this right now. Yep. All right. Three to three. Three to three. DDC. Maybe level five. Make a good progress towards the old uh, level six ice blast. It's going to be very nice this game to try and deal with what Alliance are bringing into the fray with this Dazzy. Oh, the creep! Okay, that was okay, cute. Calm down. That calm was down. cute. That was professional. Professional gamers are what Professional would have been if he had gotten the kill. In fact, talking about professional, twitch.tv slash join Dirty Yes, 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 of course. If there was a professional attempt from S4. Happy? I mean, let's yeah. say he hits the sun. I don't think Ember dies there. No. He had flame gut up. He blocks the damage. You have a lance. There's no follow-up stun. That's why it's a cute play. It, it was, was a professional play. Okay. Please. Professional. I'm sure there's another stream somewhere where someone was shouting about that play. I bet they were shouting. <sighs> you can almost see them from here. Alright. Are we expecting Silar is going to be... Grabbing another mech for Shadow Fiend in this game, I don't see really any other typical mech candidates un unless uh, oh. Clockwork's going to go rogue with something. No, I think the SF's definitely going to be the mech this game. Yeah, Just kind of, sure. you know, more or less the it same LDD really kind of a game we've been seeing. It's a silent play style. He's like a yeah. safe, stable player, and uh, maybe he's going to be the one making like, the flashier plays. So, don't see any reason why he won't get the mech. I think in a team, you have to have one of each. One stable player and yeah. one flashy player. You can't have two... Oh yeah, time. having a flashy, young, vibrant rookie player is like the new thing He's in Dota. He's not a rookie. Who? I mean, not rookie. Who's not who? for him. I'm just, let's say rookie to the limelight. All right, being in like the big time with some of the biggest, you know, teams. Your your Weehaws, your Sumails came you know, from the Falcon Bears. They came from Root Gaming. As Amber would say, balance in all things. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. Smart. So smart, so smart. But smart with an E. Smart with an E. Radiant bottom tower is under attack. Blink dagger now. Yep. On S4, pretty good timing. Eleven minutes in, he's gonna be happy with that. He's top of the net worth. I mean, five K on this tiny. Not a bad performance indeed. Mr. Mr. MMY though, still making good progression. Not as quick as before. He's thirteen hundred towards his blink dagger, on the lion. And he's got his ultimate online here as well. So we'll see what's gonna to go on top lane, Alliance. And the pressure pushing in here with Bulldog on that Jack Hero, and they should be able to make sure work here at the tier two. Looks like they're just gonna let this one go LGD. Elsewhere, MMY is actually hanging around the mid lane. The smoke up from Aki, they're gonna jump straight in onto maybe. Do they have the damage here to deal with him? He's gonna throw out the remnant, gets himself back up to the high ground, and oh. will be able to get himself away here. Yep, they're fine. Did they spot it? Looked like they spotted MMY, and that's why they sent out an ice path right there, but I'm not too sure. Anyways, maybe he's gonna be able to make it away safely. And uh, just a bit of a swing and a miss right there from Alliance. What do you have to say about that gang, Parker? Was it better than the first one? Yep. Thanks, Parker. Still ambitious. No. But. But? Uh, worth doing, you get a tower, so you force Ember back. I mean, look There's at this. Plus, a gank and more a T1 tower push. Easy towers here for Alliance. So, getting the kill was a bonus, but they still wa yeah. they, they wanted the tower. You but don't get the kill unless Ember misplays it. Oh, he, he blinks in! S4 with oh. the toss he's onto to DDC. DDC with the 360 oh. nose going by Blast, and now he's done for it. S4's got to get himself the hell out. There's oh. your finger, MMY. I felt that one. Fingers through the rock cracks. Oh and now no, good night, too early to go to sleep, LGD. Why are you going to sleep now? <gasps> oh. oh, that's a puppy pause. S4. Mouse again. Well, no strangers to the rap. <laughs> Well, after they kill that mouse, they'll <laughs> hopefully get this game underway. And whoa, that whoa, that whoa. was a big kill, actually, because that did put Mr. MMY very close to his blink dagger. Very close. What a surprise, man. This guy, it's not as super fast as that 9-minute one, but it, it performances like that, it's like, I just want to go check out the replays and follow him around, just see how he does it. I think that's partly, like, we talk in some of the past games, like, oh, pick Shadow Shaman, but they... Lion with a fast blink does a lot more than like a Shadow Shaman with a fast blink, I feel. Maybe. You have kill potential, more kill potential on Lion, and that's why they prefer the Lion pick. And Game here shall we go. continue now. LGD. Still Not only that, you know, the other thing about the Lion is the mana drain against the Kornaga. Yep. Yep. It's very, very good. Nope. No? 
You don't think so? Yep. C. Okay. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well. Well. What's going on here in the mid lane, Winter? Absolutely nothing. Thank you, Winter. Mm-hmm. You can go home now. Off you go. That'll be four graham crackers. <laughs> four graham crackers. Graham oh. crackers, honestly. We're paying them in gra graham crackers. Yeah. Oh. Bless him. Aren't you getting close to this mech? He's not too shabby. Is. He's, he's doing all right. Just got to make sure you sidestep the ice blast. Otherwise, you, yeah. yeah. But what if the ice blast comes from a come far from distance and uh. it's a very big ice blast? Well, well you need to sidestep a little bit harder, Winter. Yeah. Yeah. Do a barrel roll. Yeah. With the creeps. <laughs> With the creeps. <laughs> I'd like to see Chen attempt a barrel roll. It probably won't be very successful. He'll probably He'd just kill get himself. Flattened yeah. by his beast, yes. Yeah. Yeah. And for S4 here, after already committing and doing this nice bleak dagger, which I'm sure he's hoping to kind of get a bit more with it. Is it straight to ag, straight to a core potential for uh, this tiny? He probably will finish drums first, I think. Very good chance that he'll finish it. And then go back to his tower build if he wants to. But if the game goes. Well, they get a lot of kills. He might consider a shadow blade. Might. Those are usually the two routes that you go for in the, as the tiny in this game. I mean, some players would even go for a four star. Yeah, I was gonna say, do you think there's any chance he goes oh, back? Oh, totally that's a beautiful oh. hook shot. Ice blast straight in as well. EGM gets the grave out. Double. Still could be in a bit of trouble. They're trying to turn at least bring down RTK hey. with him, and that's actually a trait that Alliance say, "All right, we'll take your clockwork for support any day of the week." The way that fight started is just like in a whole new part of the map Did, that just wasn't there see, once before. It's didn't just so crazy. Didn't they see many heroes there with the ward? Nope. They had a ward there. Yep. On the, on the cliff. Yeah. I guess they just thought that they would be able to get a kill and get out. Not a good trade, Oldie Pixel. Oh, Dazzle for Clock? Yeah, not a good trade for LGD. That's, yeah, I said it was. I said it was a good trade for Alliance. Do you even listen to me, Winter? It's the same thing. What? Yeah, so you're agreeing with me. <sighs> Winter, I think it's past your bedtime. Good night. No. I'm Good gonna night. listen to Loda sing now. Okay. Loda? Does yeah. Loda sing? Haven't you heard his YouTube video of him singing? Oh, actually, before? no, I have heard Loda sing. Oh, yeah, no, you're right. No, I have. different songs, I believe. Yeah, I, I've, I've, I remember hearing one of his tunes, yeah. No, oh, yeah, it was good. It was good. It was, it was decent. Better than you for sure. Thank you. No thanks. Thank you. Now Bulldog is he actually farming. He got the four star, so I guess yeah, Tiny doesn't need one as much. Normally yeah, the very crucial the against the clock where you know normally you would get to see that Yules, yep. but. Okay, what's happening? S4 committing in, making big burst on maybe they have it. Oh man, that heal bomb as well. That's enough to just shred through the ember. S4. Tiny coming in your back doors, RTK. He's going to shut them though with the cold. And he's off. Well, he manipulated that new part of the map very nice. Very <laughs> nice. <laughs> Pop the cogs at a beautiful moment. They might still go for it. S4's got oh, play. Got got it. It. This man. Oh, no mana! Toss him back. Oh. No, no mana oh. for it. 13 mana, boy. Turn around. Get yourself out. Here's the mech. Popped by the boy on Silar. Silar ready to go. There's nice blast incoming. Here. Oh, but the bleak. It was there in time. S4 goes straight past. It gets the kill on Clockwork. There's a finger onto EGM. He's going to hide. That was the shortest song there of Loader's lifetime. <laughs> and now they'll just run. S4 needs to get himself out. There's the Rec Grim clipping him on the back. And oh. S4 will go down. Tried to TP out. That was a TP now. Now maybe EGM oh no. as well hit. This is bad. This is bad. EGM's going to be going down now. And they're also continuing to make chase here. They want creeps, baby. Oh, yeah. Big old stun. A little mana drain. The raises are coming through. The money pouring on in here. Luckily, it looks EGM like they were able to get a some out. Just boots. What? Yeah. What? As he was dying, I saw boots in his stash. I think. He may have moved them to his hero now, but I'm pretty sure he like, had. Did he even have boots on himself? That, that's, that can't be true. He has three can net worth. That can't be true. He had urn and wand and all this other stuff. I'm confused. I don't know what I'm looking. You just had a Maybe little I too many drinks, you know? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw a pre-sun stash. 
What have you been smoking, Taka? What's Whatever S4 has, currently. Mm. Good stuff. Radiance incoming. Just the relic for now. Every little bit adds up as he picks up this sweet little bounty rune here. Who, who is on more of a pressure timer here? LGD, are we feeling like? Or they also have a respectable bit of late uh, game here. I know we're still in the early part. They have pretty of good late mid. game against the illusions. They have Lion, Ember. All these heroes deal with. Oh, oh no, that was a blocked hook shot. Correct. Or a missed hook Thank shot. you, John Mad. Thank you. John Mad, John Mad, John Mad. Who is John Mad? Uh, he is a porn star. <laughs> what? Yep. Yep. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Like me. What? Oh, mid lane. GM making his way out. That'll be good. A little flirting again, but nothing too serious here. Ice blast on four, and LGD just happy to siege and take down what looks like Another tier one tower. The rich getting a bit more here. Shadow Fiend still holding the top net worth as it is, but AS4 is still right there behind him. Yeah, this tiny's really kept up. I mean, uh, Lions have had a ton of good rotations coming out of S4. Mm -hmm. Involved in pretty much, I think, all their kills even. Constantly being in the face of LGD, you know, keeps him distracted, and you know, they well, have that insurance Naga policy. They certainly. Do. How is the Naga doing? Relic. Uh, picked up relic at 18. So Rance is just about okay. there. Uh, we're getting there. We're just get, Lotus getting there. Along. Gotta get. Hurry up and wait. You, this could be a long game. <laughs> hurry yes. up to wait. It could be a long it game. It could be. I very much. What a wonderful conclusion to the WCA. WCA. Like both teams don't really have heroes that can force issues very well, and both teams can defend with a lot of spam. So yeah. And it's the last game, so everyone will be taking extra yeah. precaution with every move they make. But I could I could see the champ become very weak in the later yeah. parts of the game. And LGD, Dire Side, Roshan, I feel like you get to these game five long game deciders and that yeah. just becomes so much I more agree. important. That like, is a big deal. Like right now I'm like slightly preferring LGD's position and it's pretty much entirely because of the Dire Side Rosh. You know if Alliance gets into an, a position where they get Tiny and Naga as farm as each other, then it will be really good for them. Yep. If they can ever get to that stage. Okay. Alliance looking like they're ready to go here. Ake's got the creeps, even summons the little Mr. Skeletals. Committing in with the early toss damage. ROTK is the closest on the scene. Might be dishing out the rocket here, but I think they might have to let this one go. Here we have it though, they might be thinking about doing something. LGD oh. are coming forward here. They're stepping in. Let's see if they jump each oh, oh, that is a beautiful weave onto three here. So LGD have got to be careful about trying to take this fight. Alliance, they want to go. S4 jumps straight in with a toss combo onto the map, but the BKB comes out in time. Ooh. Ice Blast flies over. It's not gonna actually hit on anyone. Alliance are just trying to get themselves oh, the hell out of there. Starlar moving forward here with the raises. Still BKB'd up with the songs out. They'll be able to get themselves away from this, but actually the Alliance want to go back in. S4 getting himself in position here. The slider fist comes out, maybe Remnant's back, but ROTK takes an Avalanche to the backside here. They're looking to find the clock, oh tossing yeah. forward the Naga Illusions. They'll get the clock kill. Mech's popped an Alliance, and they just look to push on the back of this and get themselves a tier two. Yeah. Where was the Ice Blast? It missed. It missed, it was, it missed. It was short at the start. And yeah. the, B the BKB Rec Room did nearly no damage. LGD just missed their two most Oh, the toss forward, but the stomp doesn't connect. Yeah. Maybe is there with the Jukes, backs up. But just creating space, TPs are coming through. They might want to do something about this in Alliance. They realize they're starting to back themselves the hell out of there. And it looks like LGD won't quite be able to catch anyone on the back of this. So significant bit of damage done to the tier two, and Alliance playing it safe. Don't lose anything in return. My oh my. Alliance gets so much right here. Yeah, you can see the ice blast actually means a whole lot to their yeah. team fight. They've got to hit the ice blast. They have to hit the ice blast. Battle 3 will come for Ember. Getting ready for the late game. But it's going to be very, very, very tense the next few minutes yeah. because the Naga is going to start to pressure the map more. And that's I feel like Alliance have to keep the pressure up because that's where, if they're not, that's when LGD just gets the Roche bit. So. Yeah, but then the SF has has gone for a very uh, safe sort of build. It's not an item build that would allow him to speed for speed farm and get ahead in terms of late game. Like usually, if you go for Helm, 
Yes. And an early yes. Yasha, then you would farm much better. Even but this yeah. build is like a fighting build, and they lost the last fight. Yeah. yeah. That's bad for them. Having That's some cool. farm to fall back on, like ancient stacks or the Dominator allowing you to take Roche, would be pretty handy here. Yeah, That's this cool. is the main difference when you guys talk about Scylla and probably someone like maybe. Scylla is more safe. <sighs> oh dear. Owen, mm -hmm. are you worried about the lack of kills? Ah, this one was a good one. 23 minutes in, 7 for 7, both teams playing smart. It's just a good kind of balance, you know, nothing too crazy, but at the same time, it's not fucking boring. Yeah. <laughs> Amen to that, brother. Amen. But then we have a Naga here, and uh, obviously, as we know, Radiant's I, complete. I said it's a, it's a fine up. balance. Let's, yeah. let's not okay. teeter through over the edge loader with this play style. Okay. Let's see a bit more action. Well, creep action. Goodbye to the farm. Well, only one of them. Creep hype. Only one of them. Uh, right now, this type of game, as a lion, you're going to move around the map and hunt the illusion. Malachi. That's all you want to do right now, to talk to Sweet Push. And yep, the typical ruby red shoes here for Naga. And o opens up her options a lot more. And must continue to farm up, get to that level 16, so that your song... You feel more comfortable about casually throwing it out if you need to on a whim. But maybe also just in case you need to get involved with the fight and turn things around. Like, both teams can take this game very late, and it's gonna be... But the later it goes, it's gonna be annoying, because of the... If he ever reaches the point where he has Octarine and Manta, then LGD has a lot of problems with dealing with the illusions. Because the SF has not gone for a more economical build, this game. He has gone for a more fighting. Yeah. He's gonna regret it right now, because the game has gone to a, such a passive state that this build does not benefit his farm at all. But at the same time, there's not much he can do about it. Because Alliance don't want to really fight, they want to find pickoff, split the map with Naga. Tiny will be hunting Radiant around, it's possible. And the use on Jakiro that's yeah. coming soon would allow them to catch heroes too, with that hero. Catch heroes, uh, it will help remove the flame guard of course from Ember. Could help disrupt quite a bit too, a certain Requiem or anything like that. And obviously the, the beautiful setup that comes with Jakiro, so it allows him to be a bit of a, more of an initiator now, a reliable one at that, so. And of course, he's a bit of a slower hero, the move speed's pretty damn swell. I don't think I need to go much further to say that Yules is a kick-ass item on Jakiro. <laughs> and there is the go-back from S4 to get the Ags and offer more as far as a core being in the late game, so. Alliance are going to, you know, to their agenda pretty swell this game. Thanks, Drug. Welcome, Johnny English. Um, he's going for Yasha, going into Manta. Uh, probably not going to finish the Manta. Oh, the Hex into Hookshot and the Finger as well. S4 taking a lot of burst damage. The Grave will come out, but the Ice Blast debuff is on him. S4 in a lot of trouble. He's going to try and turn around to what he can. He pops out the toss, but he will fall. Does manage to get the return kill there onto ROTK. This is going to be LGD moving forward for more than that. Holding back the BKB Shadow Fiend. Maybe remnanting in, trying to find the chase onto Loader. Loader gets the song out in time. Bulldog teeping out from the tree line. The rest of Alliance starting to get themselves out of there. Ake will send Loader back to home, back to base. He's out. Okay. This might be Roshan for LGD. Because the song is down. They're going to pursue the creeps. Let's see whether they go for Roshan after this. It looks like it. Yep. Shadow Fiend's heading that direction. Ember will push them away, perhaps? No, they're not going. If okay. they're going, the Ember will come along too. He, he went top. Yeah, but I guess because the Shadow Fiend didn't have that type of item build, maybe with a Helm of Dominator and a good creep, you can actually do Rosh in this situation. Four staff picked up from Aka. They really acknowledge ROTK for the clockwork and the setups he has. We'll have to prolong him getting any sort of Agnum Scepter. I still remember it's very one of the, the best champ plays I've seen was Ake with a four staff. Four staff and the centaur, centaur yeah. to get it done. Uh, yep. We've been seeing them tossing the centaur, over, which yeah. is quite difficult because you have so much time to react to that. Yes, you see, yeah, you the see it coming. The four staff is much faster. Because the stomp has a slight cast time, so you just cast it like while the four staff is going. New army here. We'll have to see. Let's see what the plan is here next for the boys. Aka 
I'm just getting out some crucial vision here across the river. Swedes. He's, he's very low level though, considering it's like almost 30 minutes. Don't, yeah, don't, don't be a hater, eleven. Winter. Don't be a hater. Yeah, yeah I want to see the high level chant with Aghanims this game. Yeah. yeah. Well, it would be really good for the tiny. Like a lot, some of the auras are like, especially the HP aura is really good on tiny. Oh, oh. S4 looking for maybe here. They got the control, the lockdown, the damage. No, maybe he's going to still be able to remnant himself out, and he will be fine. He's got a backup one as well if it was needed. Uh, they just prove well, it's just proving to be a little bit too tricky to catch out maybe. And at this point, I feel like the only way you're going to really be killing him is in the middle of the fights where he's overcommitting himself. Just typical yep. freaking spirit things, you know. All those spirit heroes, man, they are just so elusive, so hard to get a hold of. Without a shadow blade, it's very difficult for Tiny to you know, get a kill on yeah. him. So it's very hard. But it's just the nature of their lineup, right? They don't have very good, reliable yeah, no lockdown. Even with the Yule Stick hero being able to like set an ice pass into Avatar's, it doesn't feel like if he's oh. got Flame Guard, it doesn't Loader. feel like enough. Loader, he's got the song, he should be fine here. Oh. Loader! Oh my! Oh. He held that as long as he. Ice Blast? What's he uh, doing? He what is he Loader, now? you've got to be very careful here. The Ice Blast, oh! Is he healed up? The debuff didn't quite clip him either. He has a regen rune too. He yeah. yeah. Probably would have been okay unless Ember really dived hard. And he's, he's. No waiting around, goes right back to business, so that's good. Doesn't doesn't really pull him away from a whole lot right there. He's gone. Oh, yeah. Look at those creeps that okay has. He has two creeps that can actually disable the. Oh, oh swing and a miss right there. TK. Nice little matrix move right there from S4. He has two creeps that can dis uh, disable the SF during his BKB. Also the BKB wreck room. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, very good creeps against Shadow Fiend. Yep. Ooh, and some pressure. And the force staff is also in order for. Oh my this is going to be himself? about a long game, and Roshan is going to be a huge deal for LGD every I time. I don't think we'll be seeing a whole lot yeah, of We won't be seeing well. too much this game. It's going to turn more into the, uh, the dodge. cat and mouse, yeah, dodge type game and positioning like around the Roche pit. Mm -hmm. Neither team can yeah, easily go that for Roche That's too. when you would prefer LGD supports yeah. when it's trying to catch, because Chen and Dazzle are very passive during these type of games. I mean, Chen can be useful with auras later. Uh, yeah, eventually the, your creeps are just going to get farmed up, gobbled up by an Ember no, Spirit. No, I think late game Chen is all about getting the right creeps, the aura creeps, the Granite Golem yeah. especially. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. That's and yeah, and get the, the sendback plays as well. Like yep. That's one of your best. Being able to, like, you can TP the Naga back and then she boots and travels back into a fight, for example. Yeah. But A and Lion are just much more, you know, yep. oh, I aggressive. Mean, AA hard counters dazzle Chen in some ways. Yeah, getting an Aghanims on the A would be really big this game for him, but he's really poor right now, so it's gonna take take a while. Wow, this is a wow, this could be a bit risky. I yeah. RTK. RTK ready to go. RTK straight in with a hook shot says for the finger as well. Can he push back by the cogs? The ice oh pass is gonna pass God. over. S4 gets bursted down. Down for 60 seconds. They're moving in for more. RTK with the blade mail right, trying to chase down EGM. Loader Loader gets the song out. Can they try and turn? They just gotta get themselves the hell out. EGM with the TP way. Loader gets sent back and AK as well able to get off the teleportation scroll. So back to base for them, but they do lose S4 off the back of that, and now LGD themselves, they'll look to return to the Roche pit and try and take the Aegis. Didn't he see the rocket, but what, he's still doing the Roche? Like he I didn't run away for some reason. That he never tried to run. I guess he just thought he would have the sleep to back him up. But I mean, you look at your teammates, you're like, okay, I've got sleep, I've got grave, I've got Chen Sen back. I but they were like so far away. They yeah. were like across the cliff. They were around the I cliff area. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, the Positioning wasn't it? Alliance just don't have a draft that can go for Roche from the radiant side either. Even with finding a DD rune, it was very much like misled Tiny into thinking he could do something. Yeah, I, I think he maybe thought that his team was a bit nearer than yeah. he expected. Yeah, yeah. I think and so. he tried to be too aggressive. It's game five. The guys oh probably man. maybe. He can they lock him down for man. long enough? They, they really can't. They they this can't. is the issue. They, I, they need a hex or something. And Jakiro, I don't see that Jakiro coming. Jakiro has to get a hex. This he's got to get a hex. Even if he didn't remnant out there and like three, four heroes came to gank him, he still gets away. Quite like, yes. <laughs> That's the issue. I just foresee that Lotus is going to be taking most of the farm on the map here soon when his Naga becomes a problem. Um, you know? If but the game goes very long and Bulldog doesn't die, that's how you get your goal. Yeah. yeah. It's still possible. Yeah. But the other option is getting the hex would be on the Chen. So then, but then you have to forego going for the Aghanims, which... Oh, man. It's just these these guys are getting huge on LGD. Daedalus, complete on your Ember Spirit. It's going to hurt. Blink. It is going to hurt. Radiant so you can blink Yule's the Ember. Okay, I don't know why with the cheeky this spine. Is Ice Blast this over here. Oh, all the Bayem down onto the boy there in the purple. Dazzle hits the deck. 
Oh, yep. LGD getting some momentum from the rush right oh, now. Oh, here we go. The classic alliance. Ooh. S4 in routing position. Cloned and ready. Goes for it. Safe it. And it won't be easy for them to rat this game because Looks of like Amber. Amber is a very good call to deal with all these type of situations. Aghanim's yeah. AA nearly complete. And because they c like it's not it's not like Ember comes back to defend, they can try and punish him by killing him off. It, there's no threat to an Ember. Ember can always TP back to defend Rat Dota, even if there's three, four heroes there. Yep. This is actually a really good game for Ember. Like this, yeah. just the inherited advantage of the lineup Alliance has. Gives Gem Ember so much too. space and opportunities to just play very aggressive and they can't do much about it. Now could have a gem they can help D Ward and make sure they have all that extra map control. They will see any sort of cheeky alliance plays from here on out. There's a BKB on S4 and he did need that, so you know, nice pick up for him, but he still needs a bit of attack speed to get the wallet through. So still a bit of a time to go, but it does go on, you know, with that Naga, Alliance definitely have the, the potential to kind of just postpone the ending of this game and, and maybe eventually find the, the kind of regain a hold on it. Because at the moment it is definitely this Ember and Shadow Fiend getting away with a lot thanks to the backup of the strong supports of LGD. And being on Dyer's side in this type yeah. of game yeah. is just huge. Yeah. I feel like even when Naga continues to farm, get like a fourth, fifth, sixth big item up, it's not going to change the, the, the flow of the game necessarily. Uh, I think both of them has to get to that stage, like I mentioned. The tiny, and the, the tiny yeah. and the Naga. But if, do you if feel only like one gets there, then it would be... If SF and Ember at the same place, and then these supports, the clockwork has an act, like, LGD is going to have more luxury items, do you feel like Alliance, like, if they get to that point, is it even a 50-50 chance? Cause yeah, I, I think so, because Naga late game is a song, there's so many possibilities of stuff that you don't expect happening. And it's okay. very, you, you've seen it before, like from America. Yeah, Those yeah, games yeah, that you think they cannot win anymore, but you still can make it happen for them. That is the problem. It's, I think it's the head-on fight, which I'm just like, there's no way Alliance can Yeah, but they don't fight. have to fight head-on, yeah, that's the thing. They cut the creeps with Naga, if you reach that stage where you have Octarine, Manta. See there, it's still a very even yeah, game in terms of it's network. It's still going to be a while before they get to that stage, but yeah. I don't think LGD wants it to get to that stage. Yeah. You gotta give uh, yeah, that shout-out to Miracle, man who really put the Radiance Naga in the spotlight. The man who ruined Dota. Yeah, shout out, I was about to say. <laughs> so a lot of people have uh, <laughs> other words for him, perhaps. Got to meet the guy at Nene. He's super cool, super nice guy, but really ruined Dota. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see if Loda can channel his inner Oh, the hook shot from OTK is huge. I saw on the minimap, not on the camera, because these Chinese lads are looking at Loda. Are you for Come real? On. Are you for real? Come on, Chinese observers. Step it up, please. I got to channel that inner Russian cast and just... Follow the, the Chinese players, follow They're ROTK. They're just so biased, they didn't want to show ROTK mess up something, I guess. OD Pixel, commending you for map awareness. Thank you, I was looking at the map, sir. I was looking at the map. I saw him zip in. Oh. Oh. This game will slow down But he has DD for the next fight. So, LGD are in a position oh. where they can play. They have ages still, right? Uh, it should yeah. be finishing they soon. It should be expiring soon. I think it's less than two minutes left. Okay. Radiant, doing the work here. It's really it's be hard for Naga and Tiny because then definitely we'll see butterflies. I feel like on SF, which they can't really easily deal with the evasion this game. <laughs> Wait for someone to get a, you know, rod of ethos. <laughs> 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 like the frontline S if. LG get like a, they all the, it feels like the SF is the one here who really needs another item. Um, it will be fine for the Tiny to get it, but obviously Naga will never get MJD. Yeah. And Tiny, well before that you need some attack speed anyway. <coughs> but. Next choice yeah. probably AC. But I guess the if tiny. he sees he the, needs an AC. Yeah, if definitely. he sees the Eagle Song, yeah. I don't, I think he Straight MKB, he still yeah, he it's hits it's still slow. weird, but ah, he's got to go. But LGD with the butterfly on SF could look at this Rafa on LGD cam cameraman. Come on, Unless they, I uh, trust in the cameraman. Here we go. All he needed was a little bit of trust. RTK oh. waiting to lead in here with the wraparound smoke. They've got the backup. Caesar. They're gonna see AK. They're gonna see that beautiful man. And they're gonna jump on him. Loda's not that and close. They didn't quite have vision all the way. No, oh, they did yeah, see they him did. come up. They had the ward on the high the ground. Ward. Yeah. Night vision, the hero maybe didn't, but the ward did. Yeah, I mean, maybe content with the fact that they were going up the lanes. They feel like they've just got the space now to pressure in the mid and try and force Alliance it back. It was a very awkward spot to fight, and like all the heroes were just kind of split apart too much. 
you can't really guarantee a good ice blast when it's such an open yeah, kind of field. Yeah, and there. they just went for the much safer play, the yeah. guaranteed objective. They got a tower from that. At least they didn't waste their time running around. Yep. So Ember, he was kind enough to kill before with a BKB. Should never die unless he overextends in the fight. Should never die. But, you know, we've seen stuff happen. Maybe he will. So right now with the gem, okay. Okay. Oh. Kay. So far, LGD has much better vision on the map thanks to the gem, but somehow A still dies to the tiny. Oh, yeah, they have a ward there. Okay, that's why Alliance have a ward. Oh, okay. we're gonna see a bit of a chase down here, but not a lot they can do about this. You know, kind of gives them maybe the old run around, but not gonna do anything there. He's yeah, we'll probably miss it anyways. Anyone building a hex? So, blink 2.5k gold bulldog definitely. Yep. Could on this go guy, through. it's probably on the Jackie. And Chen, have you seen if it's ags or hex or nope. anything? Did not see. Okay. Find out in a bit. But the timing for LG right now is gonna be with the butterfly on Shadow Fiend. Yep. That will be their strong timing. When they get butterfly, <laughs> um, butterfly ages. They might wait for the next Roshan. They already they lost ages, so. Yeah, they might wait for it. Butterfly plus the next Roshan. Yep. But I'm not sure if that will actually give the tiny enough time to finish his uh, MKB if he wants to. Or get a MKB. It feels like even with those items, LGD need a, a pick off of or something. And Naga should start to do Naga things, and Lion has to, you know, at this stage, the Lion has to start running around dealing with the illusions. Yep. Dude, Lion needs food to travel. I'm sure that, uh, that could be the late game item. That's true. That's true. He will have to get it he's at some rich. point. He's rich. He's already 8.6k. He's not as rich as he once was. Maybe not now, but at some point, you want to get yep. bots on Lion in this sort of game. Yep, he's going hex. Yep. Not that Atos to get that true strike for uh, Shadow Fiend. Mm. Hex is like a bigger problem solver, you know, Dying than the Atos. Yeah. So, yeah, um. the uh, Ember is a bigger problem as a whole than the, the CSF evasion. Yeah, true he that. is going for BKB, I guess. <laughs> On the Looks life. Like That's weird. It's a lot of disables, you know, so maybe he just wants to make sure he gets all his spells off in fights. I guess more so for the fights where you have to counter fight and you're the ones being jumped because you figure usually he's one to be there to kind of help get the party started. So by then after he commits his stun and finger and everything out, I guess the BKB would help a safe exit. Mm. Uh, Roach, very fast respawn. Oh. Already back up. I wonder what the admins will have to say about this game. The guy who wrote the rule, no passive play allowed. Yeah. It's not as bad as the other game we had with LGD, but <laughs> approaching that point perhaps. Well, I, in some senses, because we had it was what seven to seven at like ten to twelve minutes in, so most of the kills we've had have actually happened early on. But the chess match has begun. Oh, wonderful! I thought the chess match ended. Oh, it did. <laughs> Apparently, in two moves. <laughs> <laughs> this one though, more like two thousand. Each one very meticulous, though, as LGD will now peak up a bit more as they have now secured an Aegis responsible here. Responsible observing from the Chinese castes, not showing the roach, not risking any yeah. roach sounds coming out. Probably, I'm sure. There's the push. Let me stop it. Alliance onto the Raxters. Okay. Oh, the tier 3 fortification coming out. That's a that's a bit of a little win here, but a whole... He felt that. I he felt that. I don't know if that would have actually gone as well as RTK would have liked, though. Uh, jumping straight inside with the BKB here, gets tossed back in by S4. Ice Blast, it's all about the Ice Blast. Is it going to be big? Coming straight through the middle here. Yep. It's going to connect to the EGM and Ake. The question is, can LGD actually close this gap? And it doesn't look like they can. ROTK, of course, hasn't got the Aghanims yet, so I'm going to have that secondary hook shot. And, and they're out. Alliance are going to be fine. They need the Aghanims on Clockwork very, very well. They really do. Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're really trying to force it. Not, I mean, some there it doesn't work, but you can see that they so do want to end the game. The important things that they need to get in the next few minutes is the axe and boots of travel on their heroes. The axe for the AA? No, oh, the axe the on the clockwork. A already has axe. Oh, has axe, okay. Yeah. Yeah, once Loda picks up something like an Octarine core, things could get a bit more tricky here for LGD. Is he halfway there? He's like 5,000 some odd well, gold yeah. right now. 
Gonna see LGD now trying to force yep. the base. They managed to get other shot on Supporto straight away. RTK looks to find oh. the clocks, but he gets forced back. Supporto's gonna be fine. Turns around with the ice path, gets it onto the clockwork. Test of fate from Ake. RTK starting to fall low, and the tower hits, bringing Silar down as well. He's gotta be careful. Does still have the Aegis. Yeah, they've got a good duration on Aegis. I don't think they want to throw it away. They should heal up, push lane. Bottom lane, rat a tap tap. Yeah, da, 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 da. Uh, just da, alliance da, da, things, da, da. you know. Just alliance. 43 minutes in, Naga with zero kills, zero assists. Let's go, Rat. Let's go, baby. Boots of Trevor time. They have to get Boots of Trevor. Yep. There's no other way right now. For them. Get Boots of Trevor level two and just hunt the Naga. Level two on the Ember, and uh, like Lion goes around looking, and then the uh, after the blink, yeah. Ember TPs in. I think they need to do that more. Like they yeah. haven't been doing it enough. The Lion has to camp in a lane and try to get the Naga. Uh, even if you don't kill the Naga, you have to be there to drain all the illusions so you you don't get ratted too hard. You get the creep wave over to the enemy map, and you can actually try to do something with that. Right. AC, that's nice. Now that is yes. nice. No TP yeah. though. Nah, no, you need the TP. You're not going to be leaving the base. That's where you let the uh, you let the Naga be. Uh, I mean, you can you can have the Chen follow you all the time, send you back. Yep, that's true as well. And they're that the ones split pushing. So LGD are just five manning, and they're normally in vision. Yeah. So you can react to their movements without a TP. And it's going to come to that point where I think LGD are going to try to force the push, and oh Alliance yeah. is going to rat with Naga, and they're going to use the sandbag on the tiny tiny blinks in. Oh, that Naga toss. now these no. These are good items for Where's Alliance right now. Welcome to the late game, boys. <laughs> yep. There we yep, go. Yep, yep. Uh, hi, little, uh, hexen Buckle up. Out. Hold on to your Buckle seats. Up. You know, I'm afraid we might actually go past that. We will go into the ultra late game. Oh, in not oh, the ultra late game. The ultra late. Yeah. I know you're not I've talking about the mythological about ultra ultra late game when the game falls apart. Well, falling apart. Tier three in the mid lane. Silent with the pressure yep. on, and he might just find this. Maybe there as well. S4 with the toss back, getting Silent deep into the well enemy territory. He does still have that Aegis back to the racks here. On the tier three, he's falling low here. Might just lose ouch. the Aegis. Gets ouch. forced away. And he's down. He is down. Wow. And that is a huge kill. Push taken over. down, maybe. Can they get more of it? They're moving in. Here we go. Oh, S4. Hook shot. Okay, RTK is gonna be the man left behind. Oh my goodness, he's getting spanked right now by and that tree. Excuse me, but that's two heroes without buyback. Oh and goodness. Alliance, my God. They're M pretty good at pushing towers. Yes, they, they certainly are. They are pretty good. What? They certainly are. At pushing. Ultra late game out of the window, my boys. This is it the right boys. now. Yep. The Alliance have found the window. They're jumping out of it, and they're just that free falling into an this could be it. Victoryville. Was that the hex that secured the kill on it Ember? Was Okay. But why doesn't he have buyback? Oh because, because... Didn't expect the hex. I because? He didn't hex The surprise it. Bulldog hex. That's your team. Now look down. at him siege. Well, this guy is just they the, the demo man this going to work. Loader. He's oh going for multiple. Man. He wants to see more BKB right from now. Silo. They're getting the punches it. through. And he's just going to have to stand there clear at the wave. Meanwhile, top lane, Loader. Just uh, having a chill out now. S4 comes in looking to put more pressure on LGD. Don't big. quite know what's hitting them at this point. 20 seconds still without the Ember Spirit. They'll get the full top set of Rex here by the looks of it. And they do indeed. Mid lane. Oh, Bulldog finishing this one off with a Liquid Fire. So two Rex down here oh. for LGD. 10 seconds until the Ember Spirit is back in Alliance. They'll play it safe. They'll get themselves out. And a huge structural damage done there to the base of LGD. That is critical work right there. And that is so much gold for Alliance. Those Rex give so much. And they All just right. got double. How are they gonna leave the base now? Uh, rapier. This is yeah. This is now rapier. Rapier, territory. rapier <laughs> game five. Go in or go home. Yeah. Go in or go I home right Silo now. Silo wants to get one, but definitely an Ember rapier game all of a sudden. But he's hasn't got the, the cash. Like really. Your name is Ake. Maybe like get the plan together Ake as names. soon as possible. Nice try, Owen. Thank you. Woo, whoop, look at that. You can't even you can't even climb that stuff. Well, that's that's crazy. That shit crack. That's a that went right into a brick wall right there. That's crazy. You can if you're Spider Man. Yes, you can if you're Spider Man. Or if you have sticky hands like you. I guess you could. Oh, smoke out Alliance, even though they are now in a commanding position. Let's do it, boys. They Good continue lane. to move.
an MMY, not a single death this game. And suddenly he's like, man, we're down four Raxes. What else can I do? Alliance looking to seal the deal with one last key pickoff if they can find it. And th this could be the game closer. The land winning move here from Alliance. <sighs> Got to be smart about it though. Yep. yep. Money. Money. Money out there. It's up for grabs right now. Two K gold. It was two hundred gold away from buyback. Yeah, just short. Just got a heart. That is the, a nightmare when you're a support. So, so LGD can't really leave their base or go for pushes anymore. But yeah. Alliance win the game anytime soon. Like, are they just going to be looking to now secure Roche for themselves yeah, and then go push? Can they the can just Alliance slow. Just they are going to do. Can just slow this is going to be typical yeah. Alliance like water torture right one now. One illusion, Naga just illusion at a time. One little SWAT there. Yeah. Five lids. Li another yeah. SWAT here and a SWAT there. It's just going to. They're gonna Murder by a thousand scratches, you know? Them to death, you know? They're gonna tickle them to death. Yeah, he's doing on S4. Can he finish the game here with the signature move? Kind of like what you did to Owen in chess, you know? You just little by little took him down. No, I gave him a swift ending. Mm, swift would have been finishing him on turn two. <laughs> you know, I, I did not go for all the pieces, you know? So it was yeah, you left all the peasants and peons. It's okay, Winner, you were a savage. Just like right now, Alliance are going to be savage in the ways that they look to starve out LGD. Play this one as safe as possible. Victory is just right around the corner for them. That's kind of smart as well, I like that. AFK preparing for the fight there. Oh, we're talking about the fight here. We're going to oh, see it kick off. S4 puts the BKB. <gasps> maybe he's dead. Oh, no. He's dead, but he does have buyback. He does have buyback. RT falls as well. Clockwork cannot buy back here, but we're going to see the Amber Bice break back. Yeah. Actually, run us into the middle of it all. There's the Ice Blast as well. Silas Tunnies now help push back Alliance oh, out of the no. base. The There's going to be a cold coming out from Loader. Buying some time here. Looking for the Requiem. Gets it out. S4 has been hexed up, but the heel's there from the back of oh, the EGM. Still taking down Loader to the Ice Blast. Has to be careful here. Silas moving back here. Pots the Manta style. Loader still doing a lot of damage. Here and they just can't oh. kill. They're just too tanky. S4 with the toss forward onto the Shadow Fiend. MMY moving back, seeing if he can find a hex or a stun. But they're all falling. They're just so squishy compared to the lineup of Alliance and LGD, having to back themselves yeah. off. And that did cost them the buyback on Ember as Alliance well. Alliance is coming back in. They send Tiny back to heal. He picks up travels. Uh, ready to go. The animals they just bleeding. Need to wait for the next Roshan and the game is over. Oh, there's no way. The sauce is bleeding right now. Alliance know it. They smell blood. Can LGD even make a move for this? They've got no. creeps just pounding in their base. Naga Illusions will scout out anything they do and... Like, even if they go over there, a song, and you just, you know, <laughs> what can you do? They can just use song to slow them down and they finish the rush and get out. The Chen creeps pushing, oh. the Illusions pushing. Oh. This is the last This stand. is it's it. do or die right now. Do or die. And the Ice Blast isn't going to be the best of Ice Blasts. That's going to be leading ROTK. Oh, he's missed his hook shot as well. This he is not the way you start this kind of play. They need something bigger, LGD. I mean, it's going to be enough to scare Alliance back, but Alliance, they're ready to jump back in here. They're holding on the sidelines. We're looking at the base for some reason. They're just watching the illusions pushing in the lanes. But let's get back to the action right down here because we're about to see it kick off. Alliance now, they're going to start to move forward. It's just the illusions versus illusions going on here at the high ground at the moment. Cogs have been popped down and LGD have backed up. Still hanging around here. Okay, moving the ancients in. So it's going to be that for the moment. So LGD just and really struggling to fight at this Alliance, point. Alliance, they scout LGD, and then they just send Naga Illusions bottom. At some point, LGD just have to get back, defend, and that's when Alliance will go into the Roche bin. You can't let them get this. Age. They know that they, it's like they can't let them have this ages. Well sign, sign your will, you know? Yeah. They need this. Sometimes it's out of your control. And Alliance. Alliance are playing this very well. Yeah. Yeah, it's almost as if Ooh, they've been in position before. He's trying to do it. He got oh, the kill. He got, he got the kill and he got the Aegis. Cheese of exec. Couldn't they do anything off the back of this? That could have been a huge play. There is backup from oh LGD. Make their way in. RTK's drawing in the extra from Alliance. The looks of down. Gets himself across. And now maybe with a BKB trying to fight. Remnant's forward. There's going to be the old bike. Some type of board up. And he might still go down. Trying to get himself out the choke point. They've lost EGM. Loader's looking for the TP out. He's gone for the song as well. Will be able to get himself out Ooh. there. So they do just lose EGM. Meanwhile, oh the rat no. action. S4's taking it up. Looking for the racks. The fortification comes out remnanting he wants to punish him for this one maybe can he catch out s4 it doesn't look like he can s4 will get away the slight chains won't catch him there but ROTK with the roshan steal the aegis okay. takeaway 
and gets the trade off for Dazzle. Dow you. He just bought them like 10 minutes until next row. Yeah. That's. Well, not in these rules. <laughs> not with these rules. You're going to get yeah. DQ'd coming right now. No, but seriously, that was. Yep. The small percent chance, that small percent chance that you could just give yourself that little bit more time. They got it. Yeah, that was they got it. That was just kept this game alive. It, alive for what? We'll have to wait and see, but LGD not out just yet. Admirable play right there. That was great. Maybe seems a bit allergic to using his uh, drum charges. He has still four left. Oh, the, the black... The he's black scared the black move. I saw him there, like when he's chasing the tiny. I'm like, he has four drum charges. He's still not going to pop them to chase. Mm -hmm. The person who will finish the drum charges is aggressive. Aggressive. Yeah, yeah that by guy. Like 15, 20 minutes. That in. guy. Oh, bra no drum he, charges yeah, he left. breaks his drums like the second he buys them. It's Let's ridiculous. It. <laughs> and then you have people like we were saying, like black, who just forget they have charges on drums. You know, never seem to remember to use them. Okay, he's now picked up by Cyrus. So something else to add to these fights, but we've seen so far, very hard at this point for LGD. I hear a hex. I think it's an illusion, perhaps. A lion just yeah, getting rid of a Oh, it's a lion, yeah. Alliance, they're ready to go for the death push. They're ready to jump in. They're going to go through the middle here. Okay. See how they make the jump here. here. Loader moving forward well, here. Looking sleep for them, he goes for the racks. Oh, oh move not up, like up, this. Move up. Not oh, like this. Oh, man. This is how the you just... The classic Alliance finish. That's how you Wouldn't just have done it any other way. Oh. You, that's how and you get wins. The Mega Creeps are out. Hookshot from RTK, though. They will catch EGM. EGM oh, breaks himself in. Out. Starts to walk away, but the chains are out. EGM is going to go down. They've got an Ice Blast flying across here. Can they find anything more? Remnanting in. They may be trying to find some action. Illusions have been popped out, and Alliance are moving themselves away. BKB has been popped as well, and they've just got to back up and clear oh, out these man. Creeps from the base. There's a knife Rat. in the heart, there and go. they're bleeding out right now. It's hard to watch. He's faster. Turn the, turn the cameras stronger. away. He's the donga. Oh, you just man. got that move totally wrong. I know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was all. <laughs> <laughs> he's faster. He's stronger. He's the donga. Okay. <laughs> nice, yeah. one, nice one, gods. Well, come on. That was Go actually, fuck yourself. That, that was actually good. <laughs> come on. Come on, guys. Oh, man. Don't fight. That was good. It was good. Thanks, Winter. Yeah, what a guy. Un this is hard now if you're LGD. This is now what? You got to go into plan, plan C. Plan C. At this point, plan B There's is out no the window. There's no more plans now. No. There's no. only one plan. You can't even. They need a rapier. He doesn't have the money. Ember doing on the rapier. Sell everything. He bought back. He spent all his money oh. on buyback. So, well, not like that was five minutes ago. So he's what? What's he got? Let's have a look. Two K, three K, maybe. Shots. At best, four K. He's got buyback money, I believe, just it's on cooldown. So it means he has at least like 2.5, 3k. Even with a rapier, they just they could rat this out. A big win for them and a feather in their alliance cap. They needed it. They needed to kind of get this positive attention their way if they were hoping for an opportunity of that possible <sighs> invite to the Shanghai Major. You know, Bull Bulldog was never really too laughing, late. You know. When they actually got two sets of racks ten minutes ago, yeah. he was already laughing. Yeah, he's, I'm sure he's happy right oh. now. Some of his probably favorite women are watching this, and I'm sure they're going to be excited. Good for him. And of course, it was his birthday. So what a wonderful present it would be. What, was his birthday today or yesterday? Yesterday. Uh, yeah, a yesterday. little bit of both, yeah. I'm sure. Yeah. You can have it too. And he is going to be treating himself to a wonderful gift of some serious cash. In 2018. Yeah, take on too. Yeah. Take on too. <coughs> <coughs> Have some faith, guys. You know. I never have any faith, Winter. I know. You probably okay. never will. Oh, mid lane. Oh, there's a fight. Yeah. The cameraman's right, well, hammered well, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Tours. Oh, that corridor though. Rapier, Come on! I'll tours oh. your mother. What's oh. the rapier? They're, they're it's waiting stuck. for the rapier. It's stuck. Oh, ice pop. Ice pop. They can't pop. get it in. They're gonna get two men ice pop right now. I'd like to take this moment to say some words about LGD. Bless them. RTK falling down low, maybe trying to do what he can here with the BKB, but they've already All lost right. the clock. He's down for a full minute. The lag kicks in, and Alliance beginning to kick in the heads of LGD's team. DDC trapped up by the ice bath. He'll fall as well. Will buy back straight away on the AA, but they've already used the ice blast. And this could be it here for the boys. There rapier. it is. Oh, okay, the comeback rapier. Let's see if he can do it, maybe. So He's been trapped by the ice bath, though. He's got to do something big. Silar will heal up. He's, He's, dead. He's forward. There's the slide. Dead. He's incredibly low. He's Ember's got to get himself out. Will Remnant himself back to base. He ran this back to the base. The rapier's on oh. the deck. 
Oh, it was I on don't the know where it, oh, it was on the carrier. Oh, man. This and is Alliance it. Alliance. They have got have it. They have done it. They have done Alliance. it. Alliance. I think we can say they're back. They're back. They're back. We can say they it. Are they're back. back. They, BTS they, they've approved. done it. They, they, they're you know back. what? For now, this Chinese is really part of 6.86. Go to the Chinese stream. Roll Chinese stream. We need to see the video. Go to the video. It ended two minutes ago, though, because we're two minutes behind. Go there now, okay, baby. Go, go, go. They, I, 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 I get the stream up. Thanks, Daddy 89. Roland. Daddy Roland, get the stream up. Thank you. Probably falling asleep. Roland, get it on. Get it on. Get it on, Roland. Yeah, get it on. We got to see the award ceremony. We got to see the award ceremony. I mean, they don't want to see us. Roland. Barely awake. I think he's asleep. I'm gonna go and get go and get Roland to get the. We want to see go the awards. Winter, show. you're the new producer. You're the new producer. You've been hired. Go Winter. Winter's running right now. Winter. Congratulations, Congratulations, Alliance. Congratulations, Alliance. Congratulations, Loader. S4. Congratulations, S4. Battling. Ake. He was sick. He was sick. He looked terrible. Ake but looks sickly handsome. Looks, I know. Yeah, and Bulldog. And Bulldog. It e was his birthday. It was his birthday. And he EGM. might he might get laid EGM now. This is great. Might. And EGM back on the team again and again. And again. And maybe they'll keep him there. This is wonderful. Great stuff for Alliance right now. It absolutely is. And LGD, though, they did put up a good fight. It was a good series. Five games, you know. Yes, it was. Close one to end with. And I think LGD, they played very well. And that, yep. mo you know, for yep. if anything, just kind of puts more to how well Alliance did to actually take LGD down in this series. And a great game five to end yeah. it. It was really could have gone either way. Yep. Both teams just... It's such a nail biter, no buybacks. It was just that one moment where everything fell apart. You get to this late game, Dota, you can't. You make one mistake. Incredible and it's stuff. Over. Do we do we have the award ceremony? Have you uh, fixed it, guys? Winner, are you on it right now? He's on He's it. On Winter, can you hurry up, please? Well, after you get on it, get off and who find out? the award who ceremony. Who out? Who am out? Who am TV? Oh man. All right. But yeah, save for LGD. Ooh. I think they put up a good enough show that maybe they could also possibly overtake someone like an Empire or something like that as far as those last couple of very tricky no. spots. It's going to be interesting. That's going to be happening in the next week or two. So, Yep. Winter? Has he done it? I want to see the award ceremony. No. Oh, no. my. Bloody oh, Odie's had enough. <laughs> he insists that the people see what they deserve. We've no. been so emotionally <sighs> invested in this friggin' tournament we at least deserve to see it close properly all right they got it confirmation okay it's come present them with the fake money i'm uh, the money all right are you what sure this is, is the this actual is, this wca is stream or not just someone streaming from dota this doesn't look like it oh, oh winter please oh. do i do i need to go solve some some of this how many people does it take to find a Chinese stream? All right. Maybe now they got it. Maybe. Audio. The struggle is real. I want to hear like a post-game interview, this maybe. Is, this is what happens uh, after four days of overnight casting. I can't believe it. We're done. We've done it. Yep. We've. That was a loopy couple of days. <laughs> Very loopy. <laughs> We've done some of the most questionable broadcasts Matt Dota 2's ever seen. Like, I'm surprised we made it through without getting banned. Yeah, it's it's definitely a, a goal to get banned from Twitch again one day. I don't know. Bathtub interviews just don't cut it anymore. Yeah. I'll have to go one step further. Oh. But That's what comes stuff. next? Is there um, anything huge between ooh. now and Star Ladder? Majors. Star Ladder's before Majors. Well, right? Major Qualifiers. Major Qualifiers. So yeah. January... Third through seventh, or fourth through seventh, I believe, is the open qualifiers, and then right after that, there's the regional qualifiers. So that's the next big thing to look out for. Mm -hmm. um, we'll have a small BTS Europe from the BTS series uh, over the Christmas period. Oh yeah, that's be fun. announced soon. That's fun. Um, but yeah, the next big thing will be Shanghai Majors. Be, be a good time. Don't know what we'll be doing. Hopefully, something classier than this. But if not. If not, we'll be here Who with knows? beanbags. Who knows? Yeah. Beanbags, oh. Cheetos, condoms, and whatever the hell else we were throwing around. Yep. Um, so, yeah, it's it's been good fun. I'm ha happy we got everyone here, and hopefully they figure out how to get this award ceremony on. That'd be nice. Hold on a second here. Do we have an update? Oh, it's loading. They said it's loading. I mean, we're trying to work through the uh, the connection between here and China. Ah. <sighs>
What was the difference between first and second place as far as prize money? Do you a know? lot. Was it a lot? It was like 370k for first. Uh huh. 170k for second. Oh. It's a whole lot. <laughs> Ouch. I mean, these, these Alliance guys want a TI, so it's not, like, life-changing for them. I mean, same for LGD. Like, they've done top two, top four at countless TIs as well. So, uh, in terms of prize money, it's not, like, these teams going to be like, oh, my gosh, I can now be a stable pro player. But it's a big deal. It is. It, it's for Alliance, it's more like they won their I'm first sure big championship I mean, I'm in a while. I'm sad we can't see it right now, but I'm sure they're pretty damn happy. Yep. Yep. I mean, S4 is probably feeling terrible. And and but they had to beat some tough teams. Like they, their group stage, they got second. They lost to Liquid, but in the playoffs, they had to take down C deck. Um, Wings in the second round was probably one of the easier matches. But then LGD as well. So they had to beat. They went through three different tough Chinese opponents to get there. And it's been crazy. And hmm. like along the way, I would have to say Wings is going to be a team I will remember a bit more now than yep. I would coming into this tournament. Uh, you know, I, I would have seen a team like Wings have been like, all right, whatever, whoever they're playing, they're going to lose. But after seeing them play Coddle a couple of times yep. and showing that they're really a never say die kind of a team, and I like that. I appreciate a team that can be a bit more original and stuff, take advantage of stuff like the new patch. So they won me over as a fan. And they were the first team who were really like were gung ho about like let's let's do something new, let's do something yeah. different. So. I like that a lot. And then can't forget, we learned a lot of other things from the early part of this tournament. A certain